So, I have a question. Anyway, let me let me let me say this story. Was what, what, when did we go to residency one? Uh, that was March 2019. Mar 2019. March 2019. Went to residency one in Arizona. That's big homie right there. Um, I met him in that residency. We became really close and tight. That's how you build and leverage relationships. You guys need to know how to build relationships. Life is about relationships. Anyway. Uh, Anyway, we were going out with the group and we got to the dinner hall, right? That was a dinner hall in GCU, mm -hmm. in the university mm -hmm. dinner hall. And um, we were about to sit down. It was two ladies and myself. And the other, I don't know, I'm trying not to be judgmental. The other female, she's like a dyke. Okay, she's not ladylike, but she's like a dyke, and um, I have no problem with dykes. But the problem I have with people is attitude and mannerisms, right? She was, she was really acting really rugged, whatever, and I, I wasn't feeling it, whatever. So we got to the diner, and I brought seats because we got to the tables, not enough seats. So I brought seats and gave to the two ladies. Then I brought my own seat. And this dyke chick was like, where's my own seat? I'm like, you can get your own seat. <laughs> oh God, you think, you think I was wrong? <laughs> Do you think I was wrong for not getting the dyke chick her seat? For not treating her lady like, even though she's like a tomboy and she tried to act like a dude her mannerism is like a dude she walks like a dude she don't look female like her the way she talks she's like a dude and she um the reason well she don't like me like that much because of that situation i tried to make it up but it is what it is but my question is do you think I was supposed to get that seat because she's her biology is female, even though she presents herself like a dude and act like a dude and talk like a dude? Because at the end of the day, if we're competing for females, she's competing with me. I gotta treat her like a straight nigga, right? <laughs> but she got mad at me, I didn't bring her a seat. And I was supposed to treat her like a female. She was trying to pick and choose when she's a female. So I want to know if you guys were placed in the same situation, in the same scenario, whoa. This is this question is for the guys. And females can chime in too. How would you um, assess the situation? Would you pull her, pull the seat and treat her like a lady, even though She's a straight dyke. She's a straight woo woo woo. Her shoulders square like a hanger. And she talk like a dude. Her arms look like a dude. The way she talk and behave and uh, mannerism is just like a dude. Would you guys pull a seat and treat her like Cinderella, Snow White, Rapunzel? I really want to know. Somebody hit me up. Oh, chime in the comments because I really want to know if I was really wrong for behaving the way I behaved but the reason why I behaved like that was not because of her sexuality it was more of her behavior her mannerisms but I would like to understand what you guys would have done in the same situation alright peace <laughs>